Hey guys, welcome back to Beyond Seclusion. How many of you like long distance shooting? About a year ago, I got to go down to PSA and do the one mile shot. Hey, what'd that say? I call that one. That was awesome. Unfortunately here, the farthest I've got on my place is 500 yards, but even shooting at 500 yards, can be a real problem, especially if I'm, you know, zeroing a scope or I'm testing some ammo because I do have a backboard up there at 400. I got to get one up at five, but I put some paper at 400 and then I shoot. I can't tell where I'm hitting. Even with a good spotting scope, I still can't see the bullet holes at 400 yards. So I got to do this. And that just doesn't work. You know, and those that are wanting to shoot, if we're wanting to shoot at a thousand yards or a mile, you're going to be going back and forth. So what I want to talk, so what if you didn't have to do that? What if you could do this instead? So what I want to talk about is long shots target camera. This thing is awesome. It is super easy to use, plug and play. It's got arrows showing you which way to point it. You download an app, you basically turn on the Wi-Fi, you log on, you go down, you set up one camera at the target and you can use your phone, your laptop, a tablet, and you can just watch as you're shooting. That is awesome. All right, so last weekend I had my buddy Jody down with me. We did a lot of footage. I had to scrap it all because as you're going to see in some of the clips that I'm still going to keep, the wind was, it was hard. We had a, a at least 10 to 15 mile an hour crosswind and with my high tech, super expensive video equipment, it just trashed all the footage. So anyway, when we were down shooting, Jody's big into cameras. He's been a huge mentor of me for me telling me and teaching me how to do a lot of video editing and stuff. If you go back and you look at some of my initial videos versus now, a lot of that is, you know, special thanks to Jody. So anyway, he was down and he took the camera out and he ran it out to a mile. And he was getting good video. And so then he decided, hey, I'm going to take it out to two miles. All right, I will say um, we are about two miles away. I don't know if we can see it in the background there where the silos are for the neighbor's house. So the silos aren't even to where the other part of this camera is or where the camera part is. But uh, I'm literally two miles away and it just popped right up. I was pretty amazed with how quickly that came up once I turned it back on and went for it. it it was quick so I'm actually really impressed and was still getting a great picture he came back he kind of showed me what he had discovered um, and I'm like oh man that is awesome why don't you come down next weekend um, let me get this thing set up and let's have some fun hey before I forget I've had the opportunity and pleasure to team up with Tandem Cross for carrying my swag, the Patriot t-shirt here. They're going to start carrying it in August. If you want to help support Beyond Seclusion and you like the shirt, it's a win-win. I personally, I love the shirt. And with everything that's going on in this country, um, I think this shirt is more fitting and appropriate than ever Anyway, if you get one, thanks for your support. Now, if you guys follow my channel, you know that I like KISS. Keep it simple, stupid. This system is about as kiss as it gets, and I love it. It is, it's almost idiot proof, almost, okay? It's got some awesome features. The directions are simple. It's got arrows pointing, telling you which way to go. It comes in a nice case. It's got two really uh, adequate 
tripods now they do say that if you want to take it to two miles it's got to be 36 inches high so you could just buy some cheap uh tripods and mount it on there and get it up we did not have that we just took the the tripods that came with it and set them on something set them on the back of the four-wheeler set them on the ground on a box clear line of sight and we had no issues whatsoever okay so jody came back down what i wanted to do before we got to shooting here on the 400 yard range is i wanted to show that it actually would video good quality at one mile and two miles with shooting so jody had ran and tested it and could see you know the image he, he stuck it facing a sign so what i did is i wanted to take a target up there and set it down where we've got a clear line of sight for a mile and two miles. And then I just took up my 22 pistol. I set it up. Jody jumps on his four-wheeler here, and he takes off going down the road. He gets to a mile. I'm just sitting here drinking some coffee, waiting. He calls me up on the phone and says, okay, I'm here. I can see the image. I walk over. I take my 22 pistol, and I'm shooting at the target. And the, it's awesome. You know, 22 bullet holes at one mile. Of course, I'm only standing about 10 feet. So good. Video's good. Jumps back on the ATV. Takes off. Drives over here to this tower and calls me. And we do the same thing again. Now, here I am shooting at two miles. That is awesome. Okay. We look on the satellite photo here and you can see where I am. And then you can see the one mile where we shot for that. And then back to reminder where I'm at. And then we go to the two mile and it, you just saw it. The video was awesome. There was ever so slight lag. Hey, if you like this video, if you follow my channel, make sure and check out my webpage. Use my links. I've got some online courses here. Check those out. 30 day money back guarantee and optics and anything else that I can find that Amazon sells related to guns. Check out my Amazon store. I got some crazy, stupid deals there. Thank you guys for your support. Couldn't do it without you. All right, so we showed that it works great at one and two miles, clear line of sight. We're back down here on the range. We're going to go out to 400 yards, and we're going to shoot with my Ruger Precision 308. It is windy, okay? I am shooting range ammo in my defense. I think we could get a lot better groups. Anyway, check this out. Low and to the left. Low and to the left. Nothing. Right at the bottom. Nice. Can I see it before I mark it? There's a hit. Lower left. Left? Yeah. I mean... That was awesome. Again, KISS. Guys, it is KISS. But sometimes, or actually for a lot of times, I like shooting steel. Now, I can still hear it way up top 
at 500, but you start getting out to a thousand and you know, there's a good chance you're not going to even hear the steel. So I wanted to show you what it could look like if you're shooting steel. Now, these are a bit shot up. All you got to do is get some white spray paint, toss it on there and you're good to go. It's just like shooting a target. So anyway, I don't know what else to say. Five stars, two thumbs up. I love this system. I'm going to start having some serious fun with long range shooting. Actually just got a 6.5 Grendel from PSA ordered. Now I know some of you are thinking that's not a long range gun. Well, you're going to have to watch the video because I bet you we're going to have luck. I know we're going to have luck at 500. I want to take it out to a thousand. And I got some buddies. We've got some farm ground around here. Someday, hopefully, I'm going to be able to use this and I'm going to reach out to a mile. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that with any of the guns that I currently have, but I'm looking for some more. Anyway, guys, hopefully you found this helpful. Be sure to like, comment, and sub. Jody, special thanks. Sorry I had to cut you out of the video, man. The, the wind just killed it. Till next time, guys, happy shooting and be safe.